You may have heard by now about the ongoing conflict between Bay District Schools and the North Bay Haven Athletic Program that has seen the two drift apart. But what it all comes down to, both sides just want a fair shake for their student athletes. We were informed the meeting was a courtesy. Uh, they were going to change the policy uh, no matter our objection to it. In November 2021, the North Bay Haven Charter Academy's Board of Directors approved a good cause policy, which essentially would allow student athletes to start the school year at one school, then jump to another during the same season. That is contrary to Bay District School's policy. North Bay Haven Athletic Director Dustin Rensby says this wasn't meant to give their program an advantage, but rather to keep parents and athletes from having to choose between sports and academics if their child was admitted to the school through the law. Lottery. Unfortunately, our lottery runs past the start of school. Um, you know, we have kids that, you know, will have a seat up till, you know, the start of school and even after school. And for one reason or another, they won't show. And so we go down the lottery and we start basically making the offers based on where they fall in the lottery. The FHSAA school of choice policy has been a gray area for athletes moving between high schools for various reasons. And that adds to why Bay District schools officials contend all schools should operate by the same rules. With this policy, uh, if they were to stay within um, our county's organization, then that would just create additional loopholes and additional problems that, you know, we're already struggling to monitor as is. So when North Bay Haven enacted its good cause policy, Bay District Schools decided they will no longer recognize the school as part of Bay County's athletic program. North Bay Haven's athletic teams will also no longer be able to compete in any Bay District Schools annual championship meets, championship tournaments, or even all-star and all-county selection programs. We never thought that it would be held to the standard where it's affecting the hundreds of current student athletes that we have. And that's a problem uh, because that's where it hurts. Neither side says they want the school to be disassociated with Bay County Athletics, but both North Bay Haven and Bay District Schools are standing firm in what they believe is fair. We all have to be playing by the same rules. And uh, I think that if, you know, some tweaks were made to whether it be in a lottery system or enrollment processes, then then it could get there. This is something that ultimately we don't get an advantage over, but I think, you know, there's got to be a medium somewhere, somehow, where our kids are not affected by this. At this time, North Bay Haven is not recognized by Bay District Schools as a part of their athletic program. That's all the time we have for sports. We'll be right back after the break.